Dr. Top Hulk here, and today I really just, I, I want to show you guys, um, a review on Frostwalker. Frostwalker is pretty much like you saw in the other clip where I was like, look at me, where you can pretty much, whenever you walk on water, it turns the, um, water into ice as you walk. Like, if you jump, it won't work. Like, you can't just jump off a cliff and then land on ice, so that's good. So, like, if you have Frostwalker on your boots and you jump off a cliff and land in the water, you're not just going to die because you hit ice. But if you just walk off of land, it's very useful, actually. So there's two levels of Frostwalker, Frostwalker 2 and Frostwalker 1. And so the difference between Frostwalker 1 and Frostwalker 2, Frostwalker 1, whenever you walk on the water and it turns into ice, it makes four blocks of ice around you, and Frostwalker 2 puts six blocks around you. I don't really, like, get why you would want Frostwalker 2. I mean, I use it because just because it's better, but I don't really understand, like, who cares how many blocks it puts. Now, you can also obtain this from a, um... Enchantment table, although it's very rare to actually get the enchantment on the enchantment table, although you can find these Frostwalker books in igloos, dungeons, sand temples, villages, stuff like that. So, uh, let's just get, so we can make Frostwalker, oh, anyway, Frostwalker 1 and Frostwalker 2. So I'll show you Frostwalker 1 first. So it's just whenever you walk. It puts ice wherever it is. But the cool thing is, watch whenever you're far away. See that ice? See what it's doing? See this ice? It's breaking itself. So, and the ice lasts longer actually on Frostwalker 2 than it does in Frostwalker 1. But it's really just handy. Because, say, like, there's a lake, you have zombies and skeletons chasing you, you can just be like. <sighs> run for it, and then get to the other side, and then they'll try to cross the zombies and stuff, and they'll just break, but like I was saying, like, if you jump, I can jump off the side, and you'll land in the water, so it's not, like, so say I'm up on this massive cliff, um, it won't really, like, save you, like, it'll save you because you land in water, um, like, whenever you jump off, so say I jump off, oh, that failed, say I ju jump off, there's no gonna, there's not gonna be any ice, you have to walk off from land, so that's what Frostwalker 1 does, now let's go take a look at Frostwalker 2, so it's pretty much like, yo, Jesus, walking on water. So, see, this is just a little bit better, Frostwalker 2, it puts ice in front of you better, and it just makes more ice, so, like, you always have that slight chance of falling off the edge or something, if you have, but it's just so, like, honestly, this is my favorite new enchant in 1.9, there's also another enchant that I'm not really gonna showcase, called... Mending, and I don't really know anything about mending. I may do a um, video about it, like in the future. But and this Frostwalker works on every single game mode except Spectator. Well, let me make sure it works on every single game mode, so you guys don't get mad at me. Game mode two works in game mode two, and then it does not work in game mode three, right? Yeah, it doesn't work in game mode three. That's what I thought. Okay, so like, say I'm ridiculously high up in the sky, and I'm about to just gonna spawn ice in, you're gonna fall in the water and live, so, but, you know, it's, it's just a great enchant, <sighs> I love it. So yeah guys, that's gonna be about it for this video. If you did enjoy, just remember to lift that like button and share this video with your friends and family. Yeah. Subscribe, you filthy animal.